welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to the channel so frank obegi was laid to rest yesterday what an eventful burial ceremony so yesterday night i was watching the ceremony and i was shocked to see just how sudden the family was in fact the mother collapsed during that burial the sister and the brother were uncontrollable it was just so very sad so today i just wanted to cover briefly what happened during that burial so that we can lay this case to rest. I hope justice is served on behalf of that family because clearly they are really uh, heartbroken, they're distraught, they, they couldn't even control themselves during that burial ceremony. Before I get into the video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, make sure you turn on your post notification on so you know every time I post a video, I post a new video every single day on this channel. Let's get into the video. Now, the mother of Franco Beggy has been hospitalized. Beatrice Nyanchama was rushed to the hospital on Tuesday, June 28th for emergency treatment after falling and uh, being unconscious during her son's burial. While the proceedings to burial rites were being conducted, Nyanchama bolted from other mourners and started running towards her son's grave before collapsing on a sloppy path in the middle of the tea bushes where she was helped by relatives. I think Ubeki's mom has been relatively strong uh, during this process, you know, from the time his son, uh, from the time Ubeki was found up until the time you have been doing interviews with the media and even during the burial he sang in the choir but I think it all got too much for her and she just broke down and became so uncontrollable. She later lost consciousness and was rushed to the hospital for medical care. Obegi's brother and sister were also uncontrollable and at some point Taya who is Obegi's sister demanded to speak and briefly disrupted the burial ceremony forcing the presiding pastor to intervene in the prayers. She said, and I quote, just allow me to talk. This is my only brother. I used to call him Enduku. Please understand us. As a family, we have been hit hard. Sorry that I disrupted the service. Those who killed my brother did wrong. In the end, Obegi's mom was rushed to hospital and she ended up uh, missing uh, the burial, the final send-off of Obegi. It's unfortunate because we still do not know what really happened to Obegi and his friends. The family is now appealing to President Uhuru Kenyatta to help them find justice. The family has denied that Obegi lived a lavish lifestyle. They have also denied that Obegi was involved in scamming activities. They have insisted that Obegi struggled to make ends meet and he even struggled to pay his university school fees and ended up deferring that degree program for a year because of lack of money. The family father said that Frank was a good person. He was not sick. He died in the most painful manner. Now up to date with this case, guys. I think this is the final video I'm doing on Frank of Beggy. I pray the family find healing. Uh, I pray that, you know, they get some support because clearly you can see they need a lot of support. And I know that the public has been very kind and has been very supportive towards the family. In spite of, you know, what Obegi did or did not do, I'm just glad that people have been helping that family. So once again, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Thank you for watching this video. Guys, if you're not subscribed, please remember to subscribe to the channel on your way out remember to turn on that post notification bell so you know every time i post i'll catch you on the next one bye lakini wase kwa kikosa wana wepo hata kwa chera wa wepo nini inaendelea kenya yetu cha men naomba mnisaidie mafichi yangu na uhuru mnisaidie uhuru ruto na na uhuru kenya na rairo tinga pia mtusaidie mfanye uperesi ya kutosa wapunge tuko nao tuko na ma mcs Pigania vichana na wapate haki sao. Vichana wa Kenya wana haki tachamini. Vichana wa Kenya wana haki. Hata nga wana ambiga ni wenye haki. Mina wambia na mnaio na nyi wenyewe. Mutakuta kuchionea kumbe vichana pado awachapata uuru Kenya yetu. Asante.